Hello everyone. I'm Sign One News anchor Martha Anger. Here's a quick look at the top trending stories making headlines today. If you post an interesting comment during this update, we may add it at the bottom of the screen. As of yesterday, Wednesday, restaurants, stores, salons, and gyms in New York are allowed to open at 100% capacity, and people who are fully vaccinated do not have to wear masks if the business lets them. Wednesday, militant fundamentalist Islamic organization Hamas told CNN that a ceasefire is imminent as the Israel-Palestinian conflict continues. However, today, Thursday, officials say Israeli carried out another series of airstrikes on Gaza and there has been no comment from Israel on a possible ceasefire agreement being reached. On Wednesday, the House approved legislation to establish an independent commission to investigate the January 6th attack on the Capitol. Dozens of Republicans joined Democrats in supporting the legislation. The bill now heads to the Senate where it faces an uncertain fate as GOP resistance grows. According to a recent study at the University of Oxford, there's no such thing as a safe level of drinking, and consuming any amount of alcohol can cause brain damage. Researchers say the more that people in the study drank, the more their brain health was affected. They also found that the type of alcohol doesn't matter. Thousands of people were caught on camera running in a panic through the streets of a South China city after a skyscraper reportedly started to wobble for unexplained reasons. Officials say no injuries were reported and no building abnormalities were found. Sign One News will be broadcasting live updates Monday through Friday. Then this Saturday at 6 p.m. Eastern Time, join us for a live panel of diverse guests to discuss the hot topics of the week. Again, be sure to post your thoughts and comments at any time during any of the live shows. We might even share your comment. A big thank you to our Sign One News app subscribers. You help make this broadcast happen. You can download the Sign One News app by heading to the App Store or Google Play Store on your smartphone. You can also watch on Apple TV, Apple Watch, Amazon, and Roku.